Right, folks, welcome back to AC Milan. And yes, as you can see, we are still second in the league table, not going quite as good as Roma, who, well, that, no, in this way, Roma, who, um, we have a look at the Serie A. Two losses for them all season. One of them was to us, the other one to Sassuolo who uh, we are playing today, but otherwise they are on a tier. They've scored a shite load of goals. 16 wins, 4 defeats, 2 losses. They do have a game in hand, but they are also 8 points. 6 points ahead of us, sorry. Yeah, 6 points ahead. So we do need them to calm down. But there you go, look, goal scorer. 20. It's only the 7th of February, and this fella's got 20 goals already. 90 appearances. This is only his third season. Like 22 games. My goodness. Absolute mad lad. Anyway, before we uh, before we get to it, transfer history. We've got a couple of players in. We've got two players in. We got Nicolo Barella. Originally was by was going to be a free transfer from PSG. Came up with the buy now option. Had a look. It was three mil. It was three point one mil. It's like why not? So he's in. He's he's here at PSG. Uh, he was sorry at PSG for two seasons or. A season and a half, really. So that they've lost out on quite a bit of money there. Not that they'll really matter. Um, obviously, a former Inter player. He does support Inter, so it is a bit of a uh, <laughs> bit of an interesting one that he's come here. But yeah, he spent a fair few years at Real Madrid, which is uh, fair enough for him. And yeah, now he comes here. And he's a fantastic stats. Look, he for thirty five years old, he is still he's still really good. Still really, really good. So looking forward to uh, him. And he's, he's played well so far as well. If you, if you want to have a look, he's got two games. He's got one assist. And that is a really good assist as well. And then Eddie Salcedo we've brought in on loan from Chelsea. Uh, Chelsea weren't playing him. I felt like maybe we could need uh, another striker just for on the bench. Um, yeah, and he's come to, he's come to us and... Yeah, he, he's had one goal in the cup, and yeah, he's we are paying um, his wages in full. Um, we do have an optional optional future fee of eighty five mil, which I do not think uh, we will. We definitely will not be um, invoking, I guess, because uh, even at the, I don't think he's he's probably not going to be that good at 30 but yeah either way that's that uh, and the other ones were just uh, some loan signings that went out i think i showed you that in the last episode anyway so interesting stuff as for our no that's money we are a bit in the mud 28 million in negative um budgets are right five mil and uh 7.5 on the wages and we're currently spending 7.1 so not too bad. Uh, results off camera. Last uh, games out was Lazio and Genoa, I think I showed you. Um, was it? Oh, I can't even remember. No, it wasn't. It was Fiorentina and... Fiorentina and Genoa. Anyway, we followed the, uh, Cr the Cremonza game. It was a 2-1 extra time win in the quarterfinals. Lovely. We had a 1-1 draw with Inter. Uh, we had a 2-0 victory over Udinese. A 2-1 loss to Fiorentina, unfortunately. Then we followed up with a 4-0 thrashing of Juventus in the uh, semi-finals. Uh, and then today we will see the Sassuolo game in the Serie A. And then we've got the uh, second round of our semi-final away at Juventus. Hopefully they don't score four. Um, but yeah. Looking forward to that. I am going to make a few changes to the team. I am going to bring Destro and Roldi in, Mancini and Syracos as well. We do need to have a reasonably strong team. Um, 
moment. So, uh, no, actually, I want Peralta to stay. Coriani and Satini can play the next game. Lemoyne and... Yes, you haven't played for a while, Pulisic. Let's do that. Bingo. There we go. Vuka Minovic in goal. Aroldi, Mancini, Syracos, Destro, Barella, Galati, Pulisic, Lemoyne, Peralta and Salcedo all start uh, who? Oh, Rodolfi's in another game today. Um, that doesn't help me. Um, Salah will come on. Who doesn't really exist, apparently. <laughs> he doesn't have... What? Is he... Who is this fella? Who is he? Who is he? What is this? I have no idea. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know who he is. And if I play, if I took him off the bench to play, would would it even class him as having played for AC Milan? I've got no idea. Um, Rodolfi must be playing for their under 18s or something today. I don't know. But where's all the other goalkeepers? Surely I've got more than two. I don't even know who the other one is. Oh, what a tackle from Barella. And he keeps running. He's passed it into Salcedo. Salcedo gets it in two and a half minutes in. It's a second goal, and it's in a great assist from Barella. The two new boys linking up fantastically. You can't go wrong. What a tackle from Barella. He just kept running, sends it through to Salcedo. The Italian boys link up, and these two signings may be just what we needed. Get a bit more home at grown talent. Some boys that are familiar with the landscape of Italian football. Oh, Syracuse, get in. Great assist from Pulisic back in the team. Yes, this is what we like to see. Our form was a little bit in the mud, uh, well... November, December, really. So it's good that we are picking it up now. And, uh, yes, hopefully we get back into it. We can retain our City R title. Hopefully we can do well in the Champions League as well. Got to get through Atletico Madrid in our first, uh, first league. Uh, after that, who knows? I'm hopefully going to try and get to the quarters. Barella scores his first goal. And, oh, what a signing for 3-0. He's already made it worth my while. It's six minutes gone. And we are thrashing Sassuolo here. This, this could get ugly for Sassuolo. They're literally in fourth. <laughs> They're in fourth. <laughs> wow. Okay. I may have spoke too soon as they have... Oh, what a clearance. My goodness. What a clearance. Okie doke. This is, this is going fantastically well. Lemoyne. What can you do? In it to Barella. Pulisic. To... Oh! <laughs> Four... Nil, 14 minutes in. What a start. What a way to play. How... Oh, it's Barella again with the assist. My goodness. What a signing he has turned out to be. What a fantastic purchase for three minutes. I'm glad that I clicked the buy now option. After signing him, he could have come in in the summer. He might not, we might not have even got the chance to uh, to play with him. We might be gone in the summer. We shall, uh, we shall see how we go. Depends on the jobs on offer. As never know your luck. Might be a, a Real Madrid or something like that. Though I don't think... Uh, I don't think those sorts of clubs is quite as interesting as sort of going to like a lower sort of club and like bringing it up as we did here. AC Milan, historically, big club, 
wasn't quite near the, uh, the level that it needed to be. We brought in a few signings. Boom. Champions. That's what you want to see. It's our third league title in our th third different league. Technically, two of them are in uh, English leagues, but that's fine. It was uh, what, Skybet League 1, and then we won the English Premier League with Southampton, and now we've won Serie A with AC Milan, and hopefully we are on course for hopefully retaining our title. I'm not... I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, it looks, you know, it would take, it's going to take quite some time for Roma. As we go 5-0 up here, it is going to take something miraculous for Roma to slip up and we're going to have to be on form. Even in February already, we're going to have to, we're going to have to make sure we don't, don't do anything stupid. The lost to Fiorentina, obviously, not the best, but scoring five against Sassuolo in the league, 37 minutes into the game. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Not a single player is having a bad game. If Galati can pick it up to a seven, everyone will be uh, pretty much in inspired form. Um, very happy with the way things are going. We're just going to leave it there. I'm assuming now we'll probably just sit back or not. We might go for it some more. Okay. Let's see, does anything come of the our attack here? Oof, it's been cut out by Sassuolo. Da -da 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 what a game. You'd be wrapped as a neutral watching this. Or as an AC Milan fan, you'd be wrapped watching this. I don't even know who to take off. We're going to need some players fit for um, the games in, in a couple of games, uh, a couple of days' time, the game for Juve. Oh, Lee, Leo Poldo. He's managed to, uh, to pull one back. Good strike. But will it be enough? There goes the clean sheet, unfortunately. It's a bad... Tackle from a uh, bad header from Peralta and a bad tackle from Varela. It's a nice strike from Restina. I think Galati we will take off. Um, we'll chuck on Noah Petit, who doesn't actually get a lot of game time. Peralta now on the ball, been in inspired form recently, scoring a fair amount of goals. Not a huge amount, but he's he's been doing it pretty uh, regularly. And uh, happy with that, as it looks like we have eased off just a little bit. As, you know, being 5-0 five, five up, you don't really, you seem to relax. And uh, we've let them back in. Wow. Well, if they scored a second, we've kind of let them back in. But they have not scored a second yet. They've managed to score one. There's no reason they can't do what we did in the first half. So we better be... Uh, Still need to be good. As Peralta now sends through Salcedo, who's oh so close to making it six. He will be gutted. What do we got here? A corner from Lemoyne whips one in, headed clear, and that's the highlight done. Okay. Oh, we had a highlight, and Petit sends it through. Mancini retains. Pulisic into Salcedo, back to Petit. It's going a bit of everyone. Destro, he's going to take a shot. Not quite what he was probably wanting to do, but okay. Um, bring on Koulibaly. We'll swap those two around. Let's bring on... No, we'll, we'll leave it for now. It's only 70 minutes gone. Another throw in for Destro. Straight to Lemoyne. Tackled. Koulibaly clears almost. And what is Petit up to? Tackled by Jans. Free kick, and it's, oh, it's a straight red card. It didn't look that bad to me, uh, from what I could see down there. But no, apparently it's it's a red card, so Peralta's going to come off for Satini as our last one, as he seems to be the most tired 
and four, oh, look, three, four, six, fourteen, thirty-eight. Not too bad. Not a bad game at all. We did not do a lot in the second half here. We've had a couple of shots, but obviously we aren't sort of gunning for it like uh, we were. Sort of hold on to the lead and retain a, a great win. Probably our best of the season so far. Sends through Sotini. No, Odessa actually can make the save. Corner, though. Probably one of the last highlights of the game. And then we can get through to this game against Juventus. As Odessa again catches the ball. Oof. Goal difference, though, is going to be uh, could be a factor. So good that we can catch up with uh, our fellow friends up here as Roma with their goal differences. Still 10 more than us, but... Um, yeah, let's get let's get you back shortly for this game. Right, taking a little bit of a risk with the team selection here, mainly with the fact that uh, we're going to chuck Vukovic on the bench in replace and have Rodolfi start a game. Um, I feel like he could do with the experience. He hasn't had a lot of game time. He's played four games this season, uh, two of them being continental. The other four, oh, he's played four league games. He played six games. Okay. Played four in the league. Um, he hasn't done a huge amount for us, but he does have tremendous potential. So really hoping that we can uh, we can get that. And yeah, basically, I, I, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm going to chuck him onto goalkeeper because it's his bit of duty. Um, Matawa, Fernandez, Syracos, Krakow, Barella, Honold, Malusi, Lemoyne, Satini, and Corioni. It's still a strong team. We do have a 4-0 advantage as well. So I would be pretty gutted if we if we did mess this up. Um, this is a great opportunity. A lot of these players haven't had a huge amount of game time. Wow, they still have a lot of Gasparini and Delete. Okay, fair enough. Uh, our form is not the best. It's a little bit um, up and down. Draw, win, loss, draw, win-win, uh, win, sorry. Um, it yeah, will skip all this. Yeah, I think we've got a decent chance of progressing. Um, I can't see them scoring four. Hopefully not. Says so that as they. Oh, Rodolfi uh, has to make a save in the fifty-sixth second. So if we'd gone one 0 down there, I I would have I would have got, got worried. But it's still a strong lineup. Midfield is fantastic. Strike partnerships fantastic. We've still got Lemoyne. He's always fantastic. Defense isn't bad. Apart from Syracuse, it is the first team defense. It's really only the goalkeeper that could be the issue. And Lemoyne's got a free kick here. He's got to whip it in. Oh, it's been saved. It's normally pretty good from, from set pieces. And uh, yeah, let's let's see what he can do. It whips across in, oh, sorry, a corner. And Juve are on the attack. Can they whip one in? No, it bounces off. And they're going to win a corner, though. Can they get anything from this? Hopefully not. Not even five minutes gone yet. We've had a couple of decent uh, shots at both end. Everyone's taking their chance as well. We've got a highlight as uh, we clear it to Dillard. And you've made definitely the more dangerous of uh, teams at the moment. Not doing a huge amount. Three three shots to Juve, two shots to us. Both have only had one on target, but Juve a dominating position. I'm going to drop it down to be a bit more cautious. See if the cautious approach helps us at all, as they've got 60 to 40 position. No highlights to speak of just yet. Rodolfi plays it out to the centre backs. To Satini, Lemoyne. Whips it up, but Delet is going to get there before the captain. Don't really know how to pronounce this fella's name. Al Hadher. And 
Arizo. Mateus Arizo. Is, uh, he's scored. It's 1 0 at 2 Juventus, but it's still 4 1 on aggregate. Um, Martellas been the best so far. Malusi not having his best game. has played a lot of football recently as well. Just trying to make sure he can, well, not make sure, but trying to progress him a little bit faster just by throwing him in to first team games here and there. Most of the time, it's just bringing him off the bench, but. All the game time helps, as I would love to see him uh, develop into a world beater. He could be as good as Eric Lemoyne. Uh, don't see that happening, but you never know. It'll take him a long time. He's still he's still only like seventeen or something. So he says that he he almost scored there. <laughs> if he'd shot a bit earlier, he could have had a goal. Juventus storming down the wing and now. What are we going to get the header away? No, we're not as cool. What a save from Rodolfi there. Um, I feel like Corione is probably going to need to come off as he's been pretty pretty average. We'll bring on Salcedo. And good punch away from Rodolfi, unfortunately. Okay, not too bad then. Um few yellow cards been thrown out about the place. Position is still something uh, bad for us. And uh, Galati will come on for Hanold next to Barella. So we look to hold on to our three-goal advantage. Um, 75 minutes gone. Uh, I think we're definitely on the right track. Pulisic is going to come on. Malusi hasn't done a huge amount. I say that as he he just scores and he's about to go off. It's one one and it's it's five one on aggregate. It's twelve minutes left in the match and well, I think <laughs> I think it's game over. I think it's game over, folks. What a goal from Malusi! He just sort of half volleyed it. Bingo. What a goal. Yeah, we will still take him off. He, he he did have a poor performance for most of the most of the game, apart from the, the goal that he scored, so well, what a legend though. <laughs> as soon as they make the substitute and take him off, he scores. Ninetieth minute here. Could we get a winner and beat them twice? Quite possibly. Barella's going to whip in a crowd. Oh my goodness. Jacobo Sotini. 6-1 on aggregate. It's a 2-1 late 90th minute goal to give us the victory. How good, folks. How good. What a cross, in, oh, what a cross from Barella. Yes, yeah. Sotini. Bingo. Barella is an assist king. So far since he's come in, he's, he's surely got at least four or five at this time. And that was fantastic. Very happy with that. Oh, anyway, folks, video has gone on for long enough. So we're through, we're through to the final. It's going to be against Inter Milan. And uh, yeah, it's going to be interesting going to be an interesting final the two teams from Milan going up against each other how good we'll see you for the next game anyway it's going to be the game against Atletico Madrid um yeah thanks a ton for watching catch you guys in the next one make sure to like comment and subscribe peace